a brand new episode of Polycap India's number one cable and wire company Dream Home Season 6. With us on our panel, we have the chief architect of Kumar Group, Anuj Gopakumar. <music> architect and interior designer, Sudha from Swasti. <music> Welcome to the show. Home is a place where everybody loves to be at. And today on our episode, we have a home from Kodungalur. So let's take a look at Mithun Nivas. Welcome friends to the show of beautiful homes, Dream Home Season 6. I'm standing in front of Midun Nivas house in Kodungalur. The standing out feature in the exteriors has to be the ornamental designs that has been given to break the monotony uh, of the contemporary look. What they've done is a um, lot of grooving, sh you know, different shapes, figures have been provided in the exteriors. And tile cladding has also been used, like this particular you know, vertical length they have um, done using cl tile cladding. Apart from that, they play mainly played with the designs, that's the ornamental features. The color combination remains to be white and gray. Landscape has been given equal importance. On the one end, they have a lawn area. Toward the sideways of the house, you can see there's a um, garden has been provided. This car parking space is plenty um, to park two, three cars. Welcome inside the house to the official living space. It is further extended to uh, and to talk about the features in it first of all the flooring completely is granite for the ceiling they, they've done fall ceiling with led lights have been provided windows have been covered up using sonata blinds now one interesting feature in this room is that the walls are plain white but furnishing has been done using dark colors so it goes with the contemporary look uh, this is wood veneer work you can see the same work in the paneling um, there the wood veneer paneling that's uh, teamed up with texture texture work back side of me you can see that's the uh, kitchen area for the flooring it's granite the bedroom in the lower floor has twin beds for the designing it's wallpaper and the head wall with wood paneling work wood veneer has also been extensively used at various places in the house uh, flooring remains to be granite and the ceiling it's fall ceiling led lights have been provided there's a separate dress area and uh, wardrobe section windows have been provided on either sides which are covered by uh, colorful ro roller blinds and above side um, they've used wallpaper they've done so a lot of things have been done which uh, makes it a very uh, you know attractive feature a lot of led lights have been provided inside the fall ceiling and especially this um, centerpiece that that was a piece that was focusing on the uh, the dining area so this is responsible for the ample amount of um, lighting be that be the um, upper floor or the lower dining area what take on the landscape the character of the home and the exteriors uh, the house is a set in a very large uh, property it's uh, set a little back so there's a nice driveway coming up into the house yeah. with, a, with a certain amount of landscape with a green down uh, a landscape down in the front it's a large property and the position of the house and the property if you notice the gate is on the left side it's by the side of the house and the house actually faces the balanced property that is there in front which uh, sort of gives a big vastness to the space and to the house that as such so they may utilize that largeness of the property that is available to them so that's a nice thing and Anuj what do you think about its interiors? The interiors of the house, I believe that uh, it's a little dark. Uh, they've gone for very dark, uh, bulky uh, sofas. Uh, um, so that could have been a little toned down instead of bulkiness, could have been a little more light, light, lighter design. Uh, about 70% uh, of the light gets reflected from the ceiling and the walls. And about, say, the balance 30% comes from the floor. So when you don't have that 30% of the floor, you're dependent on the, especially when it's black, granite is black. So it has high gloss, high polish, but very little reflectivity when it comes to, it absorbs all the light that comes onto it. No judgment is complete without its scores. So I'm starting with you on 25, how much would you rate their exteriors? Uh, I would give the house uh, 16 for the exterior. 16 on 25. 16 on 25. And so that you? 17 on 25. 17 on 25. What about the interiors? 
uh, 17 on 25 because some of the spaces they have designed it very nicely so 17 on 25 so 17 on 25 and what about you Sada? I'm being strict with this I'm giving a 14 14 on 25 that's quite strict in fact now decor light and color the decor is, is they've done a pretty okay job in certain areas uh, the lighting also they have put some attention into some areas they have gone wrong on the color so I think I would give an 18 on 18 on 25 when you 18 on 25, 18 on 25. I think there is effort in what they have done which has to be appreciated mm -hmm. every nook and every corner has been taken into account and designed they have tried to do something there so let's give them points 18 for that on 25. Yeah. and the last aspect of judgment which is the value for money how much would you rate that um, I think I am going to give a 15 on that 15 on 25 15 on 25 and you 14. 14 on 25. So the grand total is for Anuj it's 66 on 100. So the it's 63 on 100. And the public opinion is 32 on 50. And the total would be 161 on 250.